comfortable in large lecture settings. Uh, I guess one thing that could be improved is not using just PowerPoint slides and reading from those because I can just do that on my bed in my room without the professor standing at the front. So. Okay, um, I think lectures are great. Um, being in a really big lecture can be intimidating, so you might not want to speak as much, but with smaller classes, I feel comfortable speaking and participating. Um, personally, I think the lectures really depend on the professor. If the professor is entertaining and engaging, then it wouldn't really matter what kind of setting it's in. Although I do have to admit that large, you know, 300 lecture halls are rather uh, hard to engage with. So. Um, I think that they need to make, like, incentivize going to lectures because a lot of lectures are, like, podcasted. So if they're just going to run through, like, PowerPoint slides, then I can do that, like, in my room. So they should make it where you're, like, learning more information in a different format versus, like, what they put on the website. Some professors don't let you record their lectures and I'm kind of, like, annoying. And also a lot of them aren't doing casters. So maybe that could be a lecture mm -hmm. format. Bye. Um, I think the lecture format is somewhat outdated. Um, I kind of like the idea of like the reverse classroom where you kind of learn the material on your own, like outside of the classroom person, and then once you go to lecture, that's when you hear the material, the instructor or whatever, and he like helps people who need to work on certain problems. And uh, yeah. so I, I do like the lecture system somewhat because it's uh, very convenient for yeah. teaching like large amounts of students, especially for like uh, lower division classes, but for like upper division and whatnot, it's more important to get more personal time with the teacher. And it's even harder to visit office hours in certain classes because of how large lectures are and whatnot. So the structure kind of backfires sometimes because it's helping too many people and not enough individual work. Okay, um, the big lectures are kind of like, uh, they have like a little bit of tension in them because you can't really ask any questions or else you're going to like hinder the rest of the class because then it slows down the process and they need to get the pressing they get through the content like quickly. So um, you can always go to like office hours but there's like not enough time for that because like, usually office hours are like really quick and like there's also a lot of people like that's pushed. Well people are like that thing we should like not like extend lectures but like somehow find a way to Oh. <laughs> All right. Well, um, I think the lecture format can be efficient. The professor um, can make his lecture just capture an interest. You know, have a few jokes here and there just to keep students alert. But otherwise, I do prefer smaller classes where students can be more engaged with professors.